Okay guys, today we are cooking hamburgers on the George Foreman grill. Uh, we just got our patties made up, a little salt and pepper. And notice, we've got the uh, aluminum foil. Uh, you can say what you want about Alzheimer's and aluminum foil. Uh, doesn't mean if you use aluminum foil, you'll get Alzheimer's. Anyway, put a little salt. Also, in our drip pan down here, aluminum foil. <clears throat> Um, she's adding a little pepper here. Y'all, this is so easy to do and it's so easy to clean up. Nothing to it. Okay. Yeah, you got to make sure your uh, aluminum foil gets into your drip pan there. Alright. Close your aluminum foil. And close the George for me. Let's just let it sit there. And uh, we'll get back with you in just a second. Okay, I just set the uh, timer on 10 minutes, and let's see how long this takes. Okay, and this is just a view. Uh, I don't know if you can see that, but there is uh, the grease is running through the uh, George Foreman on top of this aluminum foil, and it's collecting in the oh, just fogged up, and it's collecting in the uh, drip pan, which also is lined with aluminum. cooking away. Okay guys, it's been about seven minutes. We're going to check our burgers. Notice there's no mess. There's no splatter all over the kitchen. Everything's contained right here. Let's see. What do you think? Are these burgers done? Let's take a look. Looks pretty done to me. Or do you want to do them some more? I think they're done. Burgers are done. All right. Check that out. Seven minutes. Burgers are done. Both sides. See the grease. It's all contained. Now, when it comes to cleanup, all we do is roll up this aluminum foil in the drip pan, as well as roll up the foil where the burgers are, and we toss that into a uh, Ziploc bag. Done. Nice. Okay, uh, I set the timer for two minutes and let's see how long it takes to get cleaned up. We're just rolling up the foil here. Closes up the ends. All the grease is done there. Alright, and here's our drip pan. She pulls it out. This is the one that's a little tricky. You kind of have to be careful. We have a Ziploc bag and uh, she'll make just a little funnel there with the aluminum foil and pours it into the Ziploc bag. Alright, she's now rolling up the foil <coughs> and that goes into the Ziploc bag and ta-da! Everything's done. That took about one minute and five seconds. Done. Alright, so we also added the other foil to the Ziploc bag. We zip it up. That goes in the trash. That way there's no odor, no drips. Super easy! Alright. Get to cooking on your George Foreman.